The coronavirus has impacted all of our lives in one way or another. And because of surging cases here in Arizona, we want to look at the latest numbers in our state. The Department of Health Services is reporting more than 1,800 new cases today, bringing the statewide total to more than 163,000 cases since the start of the pandemic. Negative one death is also being reported. We know that sounds kind of strange, so why the negative number? Well, according to the state, it reflects the subtraction of a death from yesterday, which was likely counted twice. And here's three things you need to know about the coronavirus right now. Looking ahead to later this week, the CARE Act, which added $600 emergency payments to jobless Americans, is set to expire, bringing down unemployed workers' checks from $800 a week to only $200. Right now, lawmakers are debating on granting an extension to help families still suffering. In an effort to get ahead of any more problems with unemployment, the Department of Employment Services is hiring more than 800 new workers to help Arizonans in need. At number two, more than 1,000 people who work for Navajo Nation casinos could soon be without a paycheck. The tribe's casinos have been closed for months and the supply of cash is starting to run out. Right now, it's not clear if layoffs are coming soon, but the reality is as long as the Navajo executive offices are closed, no money is coming in. The head of Navajo Gaming Enterprises says if employees do not receive a paycheck, they will still have access to their health benefits. At number three, the CDC has updated its quarantine guidelines, shortening isolation to 10 days instead of 14. Patients with mild cases of COVID-19 also no longer need a negative test in order to return to work or other activities, but the CDC says those with more severe illnesses may need to quarantine for 20 days.